too long. <laughs> oh, dear. Who would be a bond servant? What an awful job. This, now, this is my most unfavourite work. Stuffing cushions. <laughs> Let them wait till later, let them wait. Greetings, Salam. Welcome to old Baghdad, gateway to the east, pearl of the Orient, and the best knocking shop this side of town. <laughs> ah! Ah, you're saying to yourselves, he slipped one in already, that's what you're saying? <laughs> yes, he has, I'll tell you why. I don't want you to switch off, that's why. <laughs> May I recline? Go. Now. Oh, dear. Oh, mine is sticking to me tonight. <laughs> Are you the same, dear? You're the same, dear? <laughs> well, regal girl, don't sit down in agony. <laughs> Nothing worse, your knickers out of focus. <laughs> now. This is this hot weather, isn't it? This isn't the weather changeable, is this hot weather? It's so changeable, because I've lain these flying carpets myself. Never been the same since. Now, you're saying to yourselves, whom, whom is this elegant, sophisticated, suave gentleman with the long banoos? <laughs> now, come. Haven't you seen my long banoos? <laughs> well, you shall see it. There it is. Long banoos. Now, my name is Ali Upla, and, no, don't, no, you're tittering, no, listen, no, don't, you make me feel a fool, no, it's, I know it's Ali Upla, it's a strange name, I know, but you see, I come from a long line of entertainers, my mother, my mother was a contortionist, well, she had to be, because my father was a midget, <laughs> <laughs> that's enough, that's enough, yes, anyway, I live, I work in this uh, house here, this is the palace, or didn't the, it's, well, it's a semi-palace of the Wazir of Baghdad. He's the Prime Minister. His name is Abu Ben Akhaz. <laughs> <laughs> now, this here is the palace of the Caliph. And over here, we have the street of a hundred virgins. <laughs> I beg your pardon, 99. <laughs> <laughs> now, oh, it's, it's terrible here. It's outrageous in Baghdad. It's outrageous. Sex, sex, sex. It's the only three things they think about. <laughs> Believe me. Now, yesterday, it came to pass. I was in the marketplace. I was ordering a joint of camel meat for the weekend. And, I mean, three, three dinars, a hump steak. I think it's disgraceful. The prices are scandalous. <laughs> they really are. Anyway, I was strolling back down the street of 99 virgins. <laughs> Take a card, 98 virgins. <laughs> And I passed the house at number 44. Another, she's a case, the woman, 44, what? Man mad, man mad. Anyway, I saw this enormous sailor clambering through her portals. <laughs> <laughs> it came to pass. <laughs> this is my master, the Wazir, the Prime Minister of Baghdad, Abu Ben Akhaz. What a crawler, isn't he? <laughs> He's the only man I know who can make an entrance look like an exit. <laughs> Mighty was here. Please, get up off your... Come on, please. You'll get splint splinters in your burnous. Oh, let me be, Ari. I've had quite enough trouble with the caliph this morning. Oh. Oh, by the venomed hiss of the one-eyed serpent. Oh, can you, can you say hiss? <laughs> oh, I can't stand these four-letter words, can you? I think it's disgraceful. Mind you, it's a problem. Worry guts. Oh, shocking worry guts. You can understand it. It's, it's his duties as a prime minister. And, of course, you see, he's got these two daughters. Two daughters, uh, Saccharine and Boobiana. And, um, <laughs> lovely names, aren't they? But, honestly, they make his life a misery. And he blames me. Oh, he blames me for everything. His last government crisis. All my fault. All my fault. You see? When we lost the last war, all my fault. It was all my fault. When he, had his, when he had his second daughter, well, we won't go into that. <laughs> Try to climb again. Uh, where was? Oh yes, yes. This woman in 194, uh, in, uh, what's that? In House 44, with this enormous sailor clambering through her portals, and it came to pass. Ali, uh, Ali, you coming, master? It'll come to pass in a minute, so don't go. I'll show you. <laughs> 
Uh, you screamed, oh, master. Oh, Harry, those two children will be the ruination of me. Uh, here we go. Bills, bills, bills. Hey, look at this. Bills, bills, bills. I told you. Those are the look at this bill for Zachary. Yes. Yes. Lessons in deportment. Oh, she's very likely to get deported. <laughs> well, oh, ever since my dear wife departed this life. Departed this life? She ran off to Morocco with a spice merchant. Oh, she wanted a bit of chutney, naturally. <laughs> Ali, if only my official duties allowed me more time to take care of the welfare of my children. Well, Master, I've done my best to be a mother, you see, but I, of course I lack certain uh, facilities. <laughs> see, there are some things I can't do, a mother can do. Oh, I suppose so. Though I must say I can't call any to mind at the moment. No wonder his wife went off to Morocco. <laughs> Harry, this is critical. <laughs> yes, it is. The show's only on five minutes and not a titter already. <laughs> Those two girls of mine are hopeless. Ah. If one more of their escapades gets to the ears of the Kali, I shall lose my position. Oh, no, Mum. Oh, yes, and you know what'll happen to you. Oh, no, what? You will be sold to the Tartars. Oh, no one says that. I don't want to be a martyr to a Tartar. <laughs> Oh, no, I am summoned to the palace. Oh, are you? Oh, yes. The caliph has taken unto himself a new concubine. A new concubine? Whose beauty is famed throughout the Orient. I wish he'd take unto himself a new concubine. He needs someone around the house to take the weight off his legs. Uh, Ali, I must go and prepare the nuptial couch. Now, look, Ali, yes. you keep a sharp eye out for those two girls. Yes, ma'am. Otherwise, you know what'll happen. Oh. The Tartars. Oh, sauce. And you know what that meant? <laughs> Tartar sauce, come on! I can't explain all the jokes which will be here all night. Continue, Master. Well, you know what the Tartars do? No. Yes, it's written in the Book of Omar the Terrible. Oh, I know, I saw the film. Oh. <laughs> the punishment of the thousand mayhems. Not the thousand mayhems. Yes, the thousand mayhems. Oh, not the thousand mayhems. Oh, the five hundred mayhems are bad enough. <laughs> It is decreed, thy ear shall be cut off and thrown to the dogs. Thy tongue shall be sliced out and thrown to the crocodiles. Thy heart shall be gouged out and thrown to the sharks. And the next bit's been cut. <laughs> oh, oh dear, what am I saying? Oh, I know, yeah, I was telling you about oh, that woman in number 44. Yes, no, in the street. Out of 56, 56 virgins. Wait a minute. Those titties came from within and not without. Oh, I might have guessed it. I might have guessed it. Oh, Ahmed! Oh, oh, so this is what is known as a booby trap. <laughs> booby armor. What are you doing? What do you think you're doing? We're only exchanging anecdotes. Oh, yeah, that's what you call it. Get out. Go on, get out. Leave this house. Go on. Oi, take your long burnous with you. Go on. And don't you dare darken our threshold again. Otherwise, you'll get the, the punishment of a thousand mayhems. Or well, at least the one that matters. <laughs> oh, like the sands of the desert, she never grows cold. <laughs> what shall I do with them? Oh, what shall I do with them? Don't be cross, Ali. Give me a great big kiss. Donna, please. Ooh. I mean, she, she's such a big girl to be in charge of a figure like that. It's too much fun. No. Oh, dear. You can see what I'm up against, can't you? Get back! Get back! I said you can see, not can you see. It's not an invitation. Now, Bubiana, can't you remember you're not five years old anymore. You're grown up now. Don't even play with me the way you used to. Don't you? <laughs> don't you understand? What I did then, I could get locked up for now, so... <laughs> don't have a cold shower. Go on. Have a cold shower. Oh, she's disgraceful. Honestly, you know what they call around here, don't you? New potatoes. Because <laughs> she's always in the sack. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, it's all go, isn't it? Well, uh, oh, what was I saying? Oh, yes, I was telling you about this woman in number 44. <laughs> this enormous sailor, 
clambering through her portals. Well, it came to pass. Pretty music. Oh, yes. This is the other daughter, Saccharine. I can't tell this story in front of her because she's so innocent. She's so innocent. In her spare time, she's a test pilot for chastity belts. <laughs> Saccharine, where have you been? And I've been to the woods with my best friend. Uh, yeah, I fear the worst. <laughs> um, uh, Saccharine, this best friend, was it a boy or a girl? Does it matter? Mm, what is it? <laughs> <laughs> knows nothing, she knows nothing. Now think hard, dear. A boy, was it a boy? You see, it's not the same as, you see, boys are the ones with long burnooses. <laughs> you see, they, you know, they hang... No, they don't. Well, they, you can hang them up or down. Well, it depends. If they you see, girls have soft pink wells. I mean, <laughs> so do some of the boys. Of course, it's mine. It's very, oh, no. It's very tricky because they have to try. And the boy. Uh, see, what am I talking about? Do you know? It was a boy. That, oh, she knows. Thank God someone's read the script. <laughs> and he asked me to go to the woods with him and pick flowers. <laughs> And, did, and you went? Yes, I went. Now, the thing is to find out how far she went. Um, well, we picked some lovely flowers. Lovely f Oh, saved by the bluebells. <laughs> see? Saved by the bell. Bluebells, <laughs> see? Isn't this witty? Isn't it? Well, please yourselves, then. <laughs> My friend did say some rather strange things, though. Did he? What sort of strange things? Well, he said, yeah. as soon as we finished picking all these bluebells... Yes. I'm going to give you one. No! Oh, it wasn't it silly? We already had all these. But it's so, it's, it's so, so dangerous. Someone could take advantage of her. And she would think he was just bedding out his sweet Williams. <laughs> I don't put these in water. What did it near that, dear? Oh. Yes? I put them in water. That's right. There's, a, <laughs> there's a good girl. Let's hope for my sake she stays one. <laughs> we don't want any premarital bluebells, do we? <laughs> well, you see my two, you see my three problems, Saccharine and the other two, Bubiana. Now, <laughs> <laughs> you see, I must find another mother. That's the only thing. The wazir must take a wife. How can I persuade the wazir to take a wife? Well, you have you seen him? He's past it. He hasn't taken out his banoos in years. <laughs> he sits home every night playing Mustafa Tiddly El Winks. <laughs> That's all he thinks about. All he thinks about. Oh, where can I find the wife for the wazir? Big wings! Big wings! Turn back up! Did I hear a voice? Big wings! Big wings! Turn back up! Yes, I did. Turn back! I don't remember ordering a dog act. Stand back! Wait a minute! Aye! Aye! Stand back! Wait a minute! Aye! You sure you're in the right show? Well, listen. There's only me here, you know. Make way for the beautiful Shanana, the Sultan's new concubine. Make way! Make way! Make aye, aye, way! Aye, aye, aye. Wait ten minutes. Don't look. Don't work yourself up. You're flogging yourself to death. Let it be known. Yes. I like that. Do it again. Do it again. Let it be known. Let it be known. Let it be known. That should any man but cast an eye upon this beautiful girl, yes. then shall his ears be sliced off and fed to the dogs. Yes. His tongue yeah, well, torn. Yeah, no, I, 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 I've done that gag. If I may say so, rather better too. Oh, no. oh son of a dog. <clears throat> Oh, son of a dog, I was proclaiming a proclamation. Did you? Didn't you hear me? I heard you in Shepherd's Bush. What are you talking about? Oh, how dare you? Cast your eyes to the ground. Get them trodden on, I should say so. <laughs> yes. You let a minute. Give them chance to laugh, for God's sake. Thank you, missus. You little of a car. Are you trying to steal the show? <laughs> yes, I heard the first time. Eyes down for a full house. <laughs> One and nine, the concubine. <laughs> No, not a 
Mademoiselle de Rabelais, Dame Shelley. Hello, who comes here? The ladies of the harem returning from their morning walk. Well, <laughs> greetings, ladies, greetings. I like them. I like them. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, the Caliph does not choose them for their brains. They think that women's liberation is taking their courses off at night. <laughs> oh, here we are. Come on, ladies, come on, draw back into the hurry, please. Oh. Come along now, please. Whoops. This is Imshi. <laughs> now, <laughs> she is the head, would you believe, eunuch? <laughs> What's the matter? I'm fed up. Fed up, are you? Why, what's gone wrong? It's those women. What? I hate them. I'm against women, aren't you? Yes, but not very often these days. <laughs> it seems the pickings have been slim of late. Yes, but you don't have to look after that lot, do you? I mean, I come down this morning, yes. I go to the bathroom, and what do I find? 250 G-strings soaking in the sink. Yes, <laughs> no. honestly, it's driving me to drink. Oh. I feel like sitting down with a bottle of wine and getting really high. Well, it's higher than that. <laughs> <laughs> you eat out of yourself. Oh. oh, dear, I've lost them. <laughs> <laughs> Poor devil has just found out. <laughs> My yashmak. Oh, he's lost his yashmaks. Oh, nothing worse. What a damn delusion, a yashmak. It's those girls that keep leaving them everywhere. Oh, dear, 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 what a morning, what a morning. Poor devil. You wouldn't believe that once he was a foreman in a sawmill, would you? <laughs> oh, you would? Oh. Look out. Enough for the coach is all prepared. I only hope that the Carnies is satisfied. Well, of course he will be satisfied, Master. He's very, very lucky. Yes, you're quite right, Ali. <laughs> You know, I find it hard to suppress just a tiny twinge of jealousy. Um, why don't you take unto yourself a wife? Oh, no, 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 Ali, I wouldn't know how to go about it. Of course you would. It'll all come back to you once you get started. <laughs> <laughs> it's like riding a bicycle, yes. No, no I, I mean, I wouldn't know how to go about getting a wife. Well, may I make another suggestion? <laughs> um, why not let me get one for you? Do you think you could? Oh, it would give me great pleasure if I played my cards right. <laughs> what kind of wife do you want? I mean, what type? Oh, I know exactly what I want. She must have lustrous golden hair. Yes. Big brown soul flies. Yes. A loving heart and a faithful nature. Are you sure you want a wife, not a cocker spaniel? <laughs> <laughs> and above all, she must be delicately reared. Master, I promise you, she shall have the most delicate rear you've ever seen. <laughs> All right, Ellie, I leave it to you. Yes, Master. But if you fail... Yes. Oh, what? Not the thousand mayhems. Yes. Ah, the thousand mayhems! <laughs> He's gone. <laughs> That's my best bit so far. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I've the... God! Oh, that's a... God, the thousand mayhems! Oh, yes. Yes! <laughs> no, no! No, no! No, no! Don't clap, you want money. Now! I told you this is an audition. Oh. <laughs> A thousand mayhems! What have I promised I've been hoist with my own petard? My petard has never been so hoisted. <laughs> Where can I find a, a wife for the wazir? Where can I find Bakshi! one? Oh. oh dear, here we go. Bakshi! Here's Dirty Doty, the beggar. <laughs> I smell trouble. <laughs> Whenever I see him, I know there's something in the wind. Bakshi! Bakshi! So kind and generous, oh, Master Bakshi! Dear. I bet I know where your caravan has rested. Oh. <laughs> Would you mind standing down, wind? Thank you. They're getting the full brunt of you here. Have you been sleeping with those camels again, have you? Oh, have pity on me, oh, Master. Have pity on me. I, I, I've fallen into debt. You've fallen into something, that's for sure. <laughs> you spun in from there. Oh, dear. Is, is, there, is there not some small service I can perform you? No, no, there isn't. No, go away. It came to back. Yes, yes, come back. Listen. Here. You hang around a lot, don't you? <laughs> I mean, I've seen 
you hanging around. These quiet look like front of the phone. Where can I get hold of a woman? Oh, why don't you try Fatima's? Fatima's? Yes, yes, the marriage broker. That's where I choose all my women. Do you? I didn't think beggars could be choosers. <laughs> Hasn't he got a sense of humour? Get off! <laughs> no. Now, Fatima's the marriage brokers. Yes, I shall go there. And they say, essay, a little delicate negotiation. <laughs> This must be the marriage brokers. Look at those coconuts hanging up in the window. <laughs> what do you expect a marriage broker to hang up in the window? <laughs> oh, you do, do you? Charming. Sharp. Oh! My stomach went over. There's no need to shout. I'm not deaf. Pardon? Pardon? I said pardon. Eh? I've heard these places make you go deaf. <laughs> <laughs> What? You can either have one like this. Yeah. Oh no, I don't want that. No, I don't want that timer. <laughs> or you can have one like this. No, nor a pencil, dear. I'm sorry. <laughs> no. Look, you see, I'm here for a friend. Now your friend. Yes. Is he waiting without? Oh, he's been waiting without for years. <laughs> yes. That's why I sent me. I'm here. You see, I right, come here. You silly old bat. <laughs> I want a bit of the other. I mean, I'm a, a, a mother. A mother? Yes, mother. I'm a mother. That's right, mother, yes, for the children, for the, the brats. No, no, I put some stuff down. <laughs> I should never have let her write her own part, you see. Now so then, yes. let's see if we can fix you up. Good, yes. Would you care to leaf through my brochure? <laughs> Would you? Would you? Well, I'll chance me on if they say right. Yes. You can see quite a lot of my brides in there. Yes, you can, quite a lot. Yeah, get back, get back, get back. Now <laughs> seen, just get back there. That's oh. Shelly Ma, nice girl. Yeah, well, I can see it's not a boy, yes. Great. She had that portrait painted on her birthday. Well, that's why she's in her birthday suit. <laughs> well, I'm afraid she's booked. Oh. Oh, no, don't say that. I'm afraid all my girls are spoken for at the moment. Oh, dear. Must be this hot weather. Oh. <laughs> well, you see, most of them are taken by King Solomon. King Solomon, I suppose, he's got a standing order. I see. Or <laughs> <laughs> oh, by Bluebeard. Bluebeard? Well, he gets through them like a dose of salt, doesn't he? <laughs> well, that's that. Well, surely you must have one. Haven't you got one more? Well, yes, I do have one left. Good, one left. Right. We'll take her. Now, who is it? Me! Good afternoon. <laughs> if she was a building, she'd be condemned. <laughs> oh, please. Look. Please take me, take me on approval. I'm ever so useful around the house. What has, dear, a floor mop? <laughs> but you're so suave and sophisticated and graceful and so handsome. The truth will get you nowhere. <laughs> oh, I love you, I love oh. him, I love him, well, take me. Yes, well, look, please. Mrs, Mrs, please. Mrs, stop, stop. Shop? Shop? I can't play hanky-panky with you. I've got a customer in my shop. <laughs> oh, it's no good, is it? We've got to write her out the series. I mean, you're missing possible this. Oh, dear. By, all, by the Nile knees of Nebuchadnezzar. I should never have taken the advice of that silly beggar. What? Not you, dear. <laughs> oh, I think I'll go home and take some more pills. <laughs> Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Where? Oh, where? I can't find a wife that was here. What am I going to do? No wives, the young ones are too well protected. The old ones are past it. They're either kept in or clapped out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what can I do? What can I do? Oh, Ella, Ella. Answer my prayer. Alice, send me a wife for the wazir. Oh. That 
That was quick, wasn't it? Oh, thank you, Allah. You're working well tonight. Yes. <laughs> Tell me, who are you? My name is Shanana. Shanana. What a lovely name to sit down. Tell me, Shanana. What are you hiding from? Oh, please save me. Save you? For who? I mean, for what? For, for what? From when? Oh, sir, please protect me. Protect you? You need protection? Oh, do you? Oh, now, I think you've come to the right place. There's a nice gentleman in there who will protect you. He's nearly, well, he's rich and kind and handsome. Nearly as handsome as me. <laughs> you dare? You dare? You dare? Oh, thank you, thank you, Not sir. at all. Thank you, Allah. I'll do the same for you sometime. <laughs> there we are. There. Ernie, who is that lady? That is no lady, that is your wife. <laughs> You never thought you'd hear that old gag again, did you? <laughs> Neither did I! <laughs> it's the writers. Oh, let the preparations for the wedding commence. Let them be rejoicing in the house of Abu Ben oh, uh, I'm so happy. Uh -huh. uh, I just can't prepare myself for the wedding at once. Yes! He's going upstairs to take his over forces pill. <laughs> oh, now, little Shannon. Would you like to think? Do you think yourself? How about a nice rose petal bath? Yes? Yes. Right. Upstairs. First to the left round the corner. I'll be up in a moment to give you a hand. <laughs> or two. <laughs> oh dear, not a moment's peace. I was looking forward to a little peace. Oh, great. Come in. Out of the way! Out of the way, oh, I dear. say! Here he is again, Andrew Irving. <laughs> Where is he? He's upstairs. Mm. A caliph's new concubine has escaped. New concubine? A caliph concubine? Yes. What does she look like? Does she have big blue and enormous egg timers? I mean, this... <laughs> oh, yes, that's her. Wait a moment. Yes. How would you know? Ah. Is she here? No, no. Are you sure? Oh, now, would Ali Utla lie to the captain of the guard? Oh, Ali, I forgot the soap. <laughs> well, let me put it another way. Would not Ali Upla lie to the captain of the Wait. Here we go again. Wait. I love that. Wait. Wait. One, for, wait, no, wait, one for the road. Wait. I love that. Wait. That is her. Out the way, you've done, oh. you. No. Oh, there's only one thing that stops me answering you. Oh, and what is that? Fear. You don't prepare to die, I'm a I'm going to die. Don't interrupt me, infidel. Oh, greetings. Hello. Ali, this is the nice man who takes me to pick bluebells. <laughs> is it? Oh, so. The captain is a nature lover, is he? Well, yes, he says he's going to take me to the woods if... and show me something different every week. <laughs> Going into the woods with a wazir's daughter, eh? A wazir's daughter? Yes, a wazir's daughter, yes. <laughs> and a wazir will be very interested when I tell him, and so will the caliph be interested when I tell him. This yeah. changes absolutely nothing. Ah. Sharana must return. Oh, bells. <laughs> she must return to the country. Ah. What a nice captain you yes. are. Nice. Shall we pick bluebells tomorrow? <laughs> Thousand curses on your mangy dog. Yes, take it in your vase. Yes. <laughs> ah, hey, Sharana, look. Uh, will, you take, uh, will you take this young lady and put her on the road to Morocco? That's it. <laughs> nice to have met you. Good afternoon. Oh, what a blessing. We've got out of that one at last. What an escape. Oh, but a narrow one. Dear, oh, dear. Where is my little dove, my little pomegranate? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, is oh. my bride ready? Yes. Well, I should do sit down. Sit down? Um, master. Yes. Oh, she's gone. Gone? She, yes. Well, uh, well uh, she was... Oh, what? She was married? Uh, your wife, that girl, was married. 
And her husband came to find her. Husband? Yes, an enormous sailor from number 44. <laughs> yes, you see, what a narrow escape. And all the caliph would have been most displeased, you know. Oh, you're so right, Ellie. What a lucky escape. Yes, for both of us. Well, brethren, we must leave. And so it came to pass that I shall leave you with the words of the poet Omar Khayyam, Jr. <laughs> when the volcano shall engulf the forest, then shall the three old ladies be located in the lava tree. <laughs> <laughs> Stay with us for Top of the Pops. That's next. <laughs>